Angelina Jolie has chicken pox. A number of NHL hockey players have been hit by an outbreak of mumps. It's a lesson to us all. Even adults have to protect themselves against diseases usually associated with children. Dr. Frida Lewis Hall is chief medical officer of Pfizer and joins me now. Frida, why are we seeing so many of these diseases come back? You know, it's interesting. A lot of people under 50 have never seen the results of diseases like polio or smallpox or measles. And that's thanks to vaccinations. Unfortunately, as you mentioned, some of them are on a comeback. And how come? when you get a vaccination, you're not only protecting yourself, you're providing a layer of protection to the community around you. If a critical mass or a certain number of people in that community are not vaccinated, that's how these diseases come back. So what should we do? Well, I gave you the bad news, <laughs> right? <laughs> but I want to give you the good news. So right. The good news, we do have vaccinations against diseases like whooping cough and measles. But we also have vaccines against other very serious diseases like pneumonia, shingles, meningitis. Many people think of vaccinations as a childhood thing, like children should get vaccines or adolescents should get vaccines. But in fact, there are recommendations for vaccinations for some adults as well. How do you know if you're the right person to get the vaccine for these illnesses? You should see your doctor. <laughs> your doctor is the person who can help you figure out for you and your family what your vaccine should be and what schedule they should be on. And in order to help you with that, we have a checklist on gethealthystayhealthy.com. All right, great information. Dr. Frida, thank you so much for being with us. Thank you.